You had this uh, career explosion with Friends, meteoric rise to fame, but at the time that you went to audition for Friends, you had, is this true, $11 in your pocket? And that was all you had? Yeah, well, I was almost 11. It was like 10 something. <laughs> 11 okay, would have been a lot I guess it's not a cool story. <laughs> hey, when it's, when, it's a, when it's 10 and change or 11, you really hope it was 11. Yeah, so. okay. <laughs> That's um, unbelievable to me. You had no savings at the time. You were kind of a starving actor, but to only have $10 in this town, that's that's. Yeah, crazy. it was, it was uh, yeah, it was, uh, I'm a procrastinator. It was time to get go and get like a real job, like two years prior to that. I should have gone and like <laughs> right. got a job doing something, but I just said, no, no, that's big things right around the corner, right, right, right around this next corner. No, not this corner, it's the, it's the next, <laughs> it's the next. <laughs> There's a corner coming up, but you know what? So many actors in this town say that, and it never happens. And then for you to say, no, 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 it's coming, it's coming. And then friends comes. Yeah, I, what an amazing thing. I think thing. I just was, you know, right place at the right time was really fortunate, you know, God bless. <laughs> yeah. What job would you have uh, gotten, do you think, if, let's say friends hadn't come along and you just had to get a job just to pay the rent, what would you have, what would be your first choice? Um, well, I guess I probably would have scoured the neighborhood for like a construction crew and got on a construction You just want to get on another bulldozer. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, of course, an amazing break and uh, friends. And now you're on episodes. I love the show. It's oh, hilarious. It's a lot of fun. It's yeah. a really funny show. And you shoot the show in London. And I'm curious, you must spend a lot of time in London. Are you picking up any of the British phrases over there? Uh, yeah, there's, there's, there's one I've noticed that they use quite a bit. It's, mm -hmm. um, it begins with a C, then it's a U, then it's an N. Okay, all right, yeah, yeah. okay. And they use it They like, use that, they use... Yeah. And in, in this Gender country, neutral is yeah. they use it there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Here, you never say that word. No, like no one says no that no word no. here. Over there, they are saying, you know, oh, you silly... And they talk to each other like, like, I've heard it used as a term of endearment. I've heard it used like in an argument. It's like, it's like dude. They, they do, I've noticed like, that. They use it like dude. Yeah, like bro. Yeah. Well, not bro, but anyway, they, uh, <laughs> they use that word. I've noticed that over there. They say it all the time. And if you're an American, it's really shocking, you know? And, and yeah. you go over there and you expect, if you grew up watching Mary Poppins, it's all gonna be like chip, chip, cheerio, you know? Yeah. And then you get there and they're saying the C word left and right. It's chip, chip, cheery. And it's, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, you even use that word because it's so common, and, and you have two of um, uh, these amazing actors on your program. Uh, the, the, the producers that you're working with are yeah, great Stephen British Mangan actors. and Thames and Greg. Yeah. They're just absolutely amazing. Um, you have used the C word on the show because it's written and it's, 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 uh, yeah, it's there done was, over. There was an episode where I call, my, I say it to my ex-wife in mm -hmm. the show, which which was really funny because in real life, you know, I'm, you know, I'm playing myself. So you're I, playing, yes, you're paying, so playing Matt LeBlanc. This weird version of myself. So yeah. I, I was like, oh, well, I better do a little damage control. So I called my ex-wife in real life and I said, hey, listen, <clears throat> in the show coming up, I call my ex-wife in the show this word. Mm -hmm. And um, I say it not in a nasty way, but still it's that word. So, and I just wanted to let you know it's not a dig at you in any mm -hmm. way, shape or form. <laughs> God bless her. She goes, I don't watch your show. <laughs>